Well, greetings on a Friday. Lee Harder, TND, with some, I wouldn't say so much headlines today as some, uh, let's just say looking ahead, what would normally be considered a big Christmas time weekend here is uh, going to be affected by the weather, particularly on Saturday. I want to tell you about the fact that, unfortunately, Holly Hill has made the decision to cancel its festival and parade for Saturday. We'll await any further word on what, what might be coming from there. We do know that the, uh, let's just say the winter wonderland on Sunday that is to go on in the afternoon around one o'clock at one at 1281 Russell. It's, just, it's, just, it's, it's another of the events that are is associated with the big day for the Orangeburg Christmas Parade, but they're going to be food, games, live music, everything else, all in downtown Orangeburg. It's open to everybody and should be free of call, free of charge, except for, of course, when you are buying things from vendors. The parade is at four o'clock, follows its traditional route beginning at Edisto Memorial Gardens. That should be a popular thing on Sunday, and hopefully the rain is going to be gone by that point. Actually, hope, obviously, hopefully it's going to be gone for the winter wonderland as well. We can tell you that uh, also that with a big football weekend, Everybody knows that pretty much. Uh, highlight game being for us, Georgia and Alabama. Huge game, the ACC title game also of interest, Florida State and Louisville. Lots of other, the other championship games are all of interest to college football fans. And uh, we will continue to keep an eye on high school football as well. The games that are going on at uh, Oliver C. Dawson Stadium at SC State. The high school league's state championship games today and continuing into tomorrow. Again, we'll try to keep you up to date on all that and a whole lot more at the TND.com. Get over there and become a member, please.